Hello, good evening, and welcome to Monkeys with Fire. How is everybody doing tonight? Hope you're all well. Hope you're getting ready for the weekend. So we are here with another tabletop game to discover. And which one is it tonight? We are going to be playing a game of Coatl, the card game from Synapsis Games. Uh, I've been having a play with this at the weekend, having lots of fun, this beautifully coloured card game set in a, an Aztec temple. We are master painters trying to honour the gods who is going to be able to paint the best, most decorative uh, feathered snake. We will soon find out. So then, uh, I'm going to be joined by Sarah and Mystical tonight. Are you both ready? Have we got our painting brushes set? Yes, you're all set and ready? Okay, let's bring you on in then. Hello, good evening and welcome! Hello, hello. <laughs> How are you doing? Hello, hello. How are you both doing? You good? Yeah. Yep. Yep. <laughs> oh, it's gonna it's gonna be all giggles tonight, isn't it? Hey, because yeah, there's gonna there's gonna be I'm I'm going to say this name wrong at some point tonight. That is, that is bound to happen. I have been practicing. Co Coatl. Coatl. Am I getting it right? I get no answer on that one. <laughs> am I? Am I? Am I? You're trying. I'm trying. Okay, <laughs> come on, then. You tell me how to say it. Quaddle. 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 It's like a duck waddles, but instead it's a quaddle. It's quaddle. <laughs> quaddle. Quaddle. That's what I said. I said quaddle. Quaddle. I mean, of course, I look at the word and I want to say kotel. But it's quaddle. So I can do quaddle. <laughs> Let's just go to the table, hey? <laughs> and just play the game. So much easier. Okay, so here we go. Got it all set out. Got it ready for the three of us. Uh, shall I go briefly over the rules just to make sure we are all clear? Yes, they're very, very easy. It's not a not a huge amount. So we're going to have our starting player. Our starting player will be the one who is responsible for increasing each round. We have this wonderful golden feathered snake that builds up during the course of the game rounds. And eventually, once we have our four ordinary rounds played out, I can't put this last piece in, there we go. We then have the final, the fifth round, where we add a head and a tail. And then that will be it. We will do our scoring, all right? So what's going to happen on your first turn? Uh, you simply place up one of your first feathered cards. What we're going to do is we're going to set our snakes horizontally in the center of the table here, and we'll have first player, second player, and third player. But these are our player boards, and when we have prophecies, these will go around our player boards. Uh, so we'll have one first player, second player, third player. I think that's the best way to be able to present it all on the table with the amount of room we've got. Let's move this back out of the way. So when it's our first, for the first turn, uh, you will be placing down just one of our feather cards. And that's where we'll uh, begin our coartal. Coartal? Coartal? Coartal. No, you're just, you like to make things more complicated than it is. Can you coartal. just tell, can you say the word waddle? Waddle. Now just put a C in the front. Quaddle. 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 There you go. That's you go. it. Quaddle. quaddle. It's waddle plus a C. Quaddle. Waddle, waddle, quaddle, quaddle, quaddle. There we go. So put down first first card. Uh, after that, what will happen is, I'm just checking here. We will draw up a card. So we'll have two cards. Hang on. I'm, 
No, we'll draw, yeah, we draw up one card, and then from that point onwards, we place two cards down per turn, and we draw up two cards. That's correct. And when we get to the end of our, we place down our two cards, basically what we're doing is we're looking to see what prophecies we uh, uh, fulfill. And these prophecies are prophecies that we actually have around our player boards, prophecies that are available up here by the temple, and any prophecies that we manage that uh, our competitors have actually been collecting and working on. And there's a, a, a wonderful sort of give and take, <laughs> push and pull of these prophecies moving from one place to another uh, as we play. So what we'll need to do is uh, explain which of these prophecies are up at the top here. We also then have an end of game scoring, which has two conditions. If we do the first condition, it gets us three points. If we do the second condition, it gets us seven points. Now, the prophecies, they will start initially, these first ones that we have in front of us, and I'll explain each one uh, for you as we uh, before we start, they will go into the zero part of our player boards. If you are able to meet that condition, they will then move to the times one. If you're able to do that prophecy a second time, it will move on to the times two. If you're able to do the prophecy a third time, that prophecy is locked. In other words, no one can steal it. It gets banked. Uh, the point on this is if you've got it once, it's two points. If you have it twice, it's five points. And when you bank it three times, you have it for six points. And that's basically what we're going to be doing, is we're going to be trying to uh, match prophecies, duplicate it numerous times. Every time we hit to three, uh, three times within our quaddle, we're able to get six points and bank it, and nobody can steal it from us. But if we have it zero, one, or two, that prophecy can be stolen by another player. All right. Shall I show you what your pro starting prophecies are? And I think the way we'll do this is, how about Sarah, Mystical, and myself? All right. So then, let's, uh, let's show you what you've got. So, Sarah, this is your starting prophecy. So what you're trying to do on your snake is have either a black or a green, followed by a red, followed by either a black or a green. Okay. So if you're able to do that once, then we'll move it to the uh, one scoring, which is two points. If you can do it twice in your snake, worth five points. If you do it three times, it's worth six points, and then this is banked. Nobody can steal it from you. Uh, so we'll put that just there. And then your feather cards. Oh, this is convenient. Well, you've got a black and a green to start with. You have a red and a green. And these cards can be inversed. Okay. You have a red and a black. And you have a blue and a black. So those are your starting cards. I'm going to put those just underneath there. Mystical, what do you have? Your starting prophecy is a green and a red. Okay. Your starting. I love the art. Oh, the, the art is is beautiful. I don't know what's under Mystic's nose, but I like the art. <laughs> so, Mystical, you you have a red and a blue. You have a well, an, a blue and a red. And if that wasn't crazy, you oh. now have a red and a blue. <laughs> <laughs> you, you have, you, you have oh a, a blue and a red again. 
And then you have a red and a yellow. All right. Sorry that my sarcastic joke was true. I apologize. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm, because it's co it's common knowledge, uh, the prophecy that I have is a red. Now, one thing that I didn't explain, but I'm sure you both uh, saw in the video, is being able to layer cards on top of one another. So I need to have a red on top of another card. And basically, this is a split. This is where you go a half and half. And you allow one of your cards to go over the one half of a previous card that's already been placed down. I want, I want that prophecy. <laughs> Okay. I well, want well, that one. You you might end up getting it. We will see, we will see. Well, that's the that's the interesting thing about the game is that these prophecies will be passing hands to and fro. So okay, the two prophecies that are out at the temple. This is a red and blue, followed by a green, followed by a red or blue. That could be handy for someone. Uh, hmm, I wonder who. And then the other prophecy is a green and a blue. Okay, so those are the two that are currently available. Obviously, once they get taken from, let's call it the marketplace, we will replenish. This is the win condition card, which just gives us additional points. So what this is referring to, the first condition, and I'll get this correct, so let me just put that down there, just so I can read it out. Okay, you have a green prophecy fulfilled at a lower level than one of your yellow prophecies. So say, for example, you have your yellow prophecy is at a level two, but you have a green prophecy that's at a level one or a level zero. So that would fulfill the first uh, part of this, and that would get you three points. To get the second part, you... So your coatal has three consecutive segments that are the same colour, and this can include the head or the tail. All right. So you've got to do the first part, and once you've done that, you can do the second part. So three segments of the same color, what do you mean? Yep. So basically, well, just three segments, one, two, and three, all of the same color. It's it's that, that simple. As you've seen in your feather cards, they are they are split sort of by half or and they uh, form so I can actually show you with mysticals here. Uh there you go. So if Mystical was to place that down, that uh, meets the requirement of three mm, of the same okay. colour. All right. Now, just uh, just as a because we want to zoom in camera here. Remember, when you place down a card, you do have the option. You can place a card next to it, or you can place the card on top, like so. The one thing you cannot do is place a card underneath. So you can place that over there, and you could place that over there. You could even place this one over here. You can, of course, place your cards to the left or to the right. All right, but like I say, you cannot place anything underneath. It must always be to the side or on top. There we go. I think we are good to go. So we might have a bit of a squeeze, but we'll start with first snake, second snake, third snake. I might have to bring these down a little bit just to give us a bit of room. Ultimately, once your card is banked, you don't need to worry about it, so it will be off screen. It's only while it's... Uh, Still and don't valid. we have to like play all of our cards like in one turn? Nope. You, you basically in this first round you get to place one card down and you will draw up a new feather card. Oh. And then okay. after that you play two cards. So in total, we're gonna be putting down, I think it's is it eight cards in total? 
It does have a set number. Which means that the game actually is always fast playing. Uh, you all, we only ever have four rounds, and then finally we put down the head and the tail. And these are the heads and tails at this side here. And of course, every color in the game is represented in either a head or a tail design so that you can finish off your quartal, quartal, quartal. Quaddle. 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 Quit making it. Quit adding sounds. <laughs> you see, so, when you want to so play well Quintotolo, <laughs> when you're playing so Quintotolo, well. <laughs> it's not a koala. No, it's definitely not a koala. <laughs> Good evening, Lorna. Thank you for joining us. How are you? Right then, Sarah. Okay. So you have to now choose which card do you want to put down as your first... Wait, can I look at my cards again? Yep. So you've got black green, green red, red black, blue black. What are you going to put down? We'll put down the blue black. Blue black. Okay. Uh, which side do you want it? Yes. Well. I I'm going to go by whatever you now tell me. That will be the order I'm going to, we're going to go in from left to right, okay? So blue, black, there it goes. You get a new card, and you get a, a green and a red. Okay. Mystical, what would you like to put down? Put down a, a red, blue. A red, blue, yes, because you've got so many, uh, so many choices there. So we are going to be quite tight together here. Let's, uh, I'm going to put these down there, give us a little bit more room. There you go, red, blue, and your new card is a green and a yellow. And mm -hmm. I am going to put down... Oh, okay, that's interesting. I'm going to put down... A green, blue. Okay, so there we go. And I draw up a new card. Done. Right, so now, Sarah, you get to put down two cards. Okay, uh, can you hold up my colors? Just, like, peep them on the screen. <laughs> okay, we'll, we'll bring them over here whenever you need to see. Um. Keep it separate. There. So can we put... Because I can go green, red, black, and that's the same because it's either green or black, right? Yeah. Yes, yes. It doesn't have to be green, red, green, or black, nope. red, black. It could just be one of the two on either sides. That's correct. Okay, then. So we are going to put the red, green, um, and yep. we're going to put the red over the blue. Yep. Okay. That's your first card down. Next card. Um, we are going to take that red black and put it next to the black feathers. And the red black goes just there. All right. So that's the end of your turn. I'm going to give you two more cards now to replenish. So you get a red black and a green yellow. All right, let's put these away. And then what we'll do is we take a look and we see. So we're looking for prophecies here. Uh, and I've done my prophecy. Oh yeah, for sure, yeah. So you are looking for a black or green with a red with a black or green. So green, red, black. So you've done it once. So we move the card over to the one I've side. Done it twice. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So now you've got <laughs> black, red, black. You do it twice. It moves over to that side. All right. Have you done any other prophecy that's out there on the on uh, on within either the marketplace or any other player? Well, you have. Yeah. Because you've got green and red over here. Green and red. So you steal Mystical's card, and because you've done it once, it goes over onto the one side. And then I did yours as well, technically. 
Uh, you've got a red over another one. So you steal that one. So we're going to put that there. <laughs> okay. Oops. Oopsie. <laughs> I was okay. just trying to do my card, if I'm being honest with everyone. <laughs> right. Have you done a red or blue, green, red or blue? No. Have you done a green or blue? No. All right. That's the end of your go. Sorry, Mystic. I was just trying to do my card. Now let me just yeah, a likely double. story. A likely story. You notice I apologize to you. I know. Don't, don't <laughs> apologize to me. Other one. Nobody apologizes you to me. You take your attitude or else no one's getting an, uh, is getting an apology. <laughs> now, I just want to double check. I think I might have had to put, because this, this is the first round, isn't it? So Sarah being the first player, we'll put down the first section of our snake just there. All right. So goes over to Mystical. Here's your cards. What can you do with those cards to maybe win back some of these prophecies? Hmm. Well. I'm like, okay, let's do the green yellow uh, on the right by the blue. Put it beside the blue. Put it beside the blue. The green yellow. Mm -hmm. Done. And then let's put the red blue with the red on top of the yellow. The red blue with the red on top of the yellow. Is that looking correct? Mm-hmm. Yep. All right. Two new Taking cards. Taking all the cards. Two new <laughs> cards. You get a green and a blue. And you get a black and a blue. Okay. Let's take these away. Let's see how you've done. Uh, we got a blue, a green, and a red. So you get that one. You've got a... Okay, you haven't got a green and a blue, so you don't get that. Let's look at Sarah's. You have a green, a red. No, so you don't get that one. Do you have, you have a red over the top of one? So you take that. That goes over there. And do you have a green and a red? Yes, you do. So you take that just there. All right. So you've managed to grab one from the top and steal those two cards back again. We get a new prophecy. I can leave that there because I think it's, you, it's quite clear, isn't it, for you to be able to see. So what this is after, a black and a green next to one another. Okay, my turn. Oh, uh, what can I do? Okay, I can have those. And, oh, okay. Well, we can keep it simple. So, I am going to put... I can put that. Do I want to do that? I can actually put... I can actually put that there, couldn't I? And I could put... That... Like so. Now, does it have to be in this specific order? Like, can you have a uh, green and black to get that point, or what? Does it have to be black then green? It has to be black green. Okay. All right. Unless it's a uh, symbol like with your card here, where it's divided by two, where you have the option. Mm -hmm. But no, it's got to be in the order that you see it. All right. So what have I done? Uh, I have a green and a blue, and a green and a blue. So I take that one, and that goes over on the two times and then I have a black and a green so I take that one and it goes one time and do I have anything related to your cards no I do not so your cards are fine we put out 
two new prophecies. So what do we have? We have a blue. Any card that's not a blue, followed by a blue. Then we have a yellow. And I'm going to double check on that one there. That is any color, followed by a black. So blue, not a blue, blue, yellow, any color, black. OK, we're starting the second round. We uh, put down the next section of the quartal. Sarah. Oh, I should have drawn up two cards myself. I'll just do that quickly. There you go. Sarah, these are your cards. Okay, I'm going to take um, the red, black, and put it on the end. Red, black, on the end. Done. Now, if we cover up something that we did before, do we lose the standing where the card is? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Remember, remember un until you bank it, anything can change, and that's by other people doing things or you doing things to your uh, actual snake. I can put down just one more card. What, what was that? Sorry? I can just put down one more card. Yes, one more card. That's it. Okay. Hmm. What is the card on your right side, monkey? This one is a green and a blue. Oh, yeah, no, that's not for me. Nope. <laughs> yes. Okay. So we're going to take that black green card. Black green, yep. And... Hmm, hold on. I don't know. Are you seeing something that I'm missing, Mystic, that I should do? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, what? You're not supposed to help one another. You are in competition. Oh. Use use your, your green red. Right, but I can it? only do it two three times and once I've already done it, I've already completed it. No as no my... no. No no. Look at my cards. Yes, oh yeah, remember. And then... Right, that? but I'd only uh, make uh, uh, two of them. Well that's well that's fine. You you'll get you you potentially have yeah. the points. Oh, I just figured since I could only make two and you were at two that I couldn't do that. No, 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 no. You, 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 these cards are going to go back and two, back and two. And by the fourth round, even on the fifth round, it can change. Uh, it's only oh. once you get to get to three times, then it's banked. And then it's not worth pursuing that color set anymore because you right. already then have yeah, it. Yeah, I'll put that down. I'll put down my green, red. Green, red. Where's that going? The In top the front. Or? In the front. Okay. Done. There we go. So you get two new cards. You're going to get a black and blue. And a blue and red. All right. Those are your cards. Let's see then, because everything's going to change now. So I don't believe you've got anything from the top marketplace. So it's only between yourself and Mystical and my, myself, of course. So I so, complete that one four times. <laughs> so here we go. You got green and red, green and red. So you take that card back from Mystical and you've done it twice. I'm going to sort out this one first, actually first. So you've got 
Green, red, black, so that's one. Black, red, black, that's two. Black, red, yeah. And then black, red, black again, so that's three. So this one is banked. Yeah, I've done I'm it four times, yeah. Yeah, yeah, so that's banked. No but I only can... get points for three of it, right? Ex exactly. No one can steal that. Okay, you've, we've done that one. So do you have a red over the top? Yes, you do. And you've done that once. So you steal that one back from Mystical. Do you have How a do I... red? How do I steal it if if she's done it twice? No, 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 no. It's it's not it's not a case of uh you have to steal you have to do it more than it's just the fact of you're the current person you and you've done it ah. but you've only done it by once it's the race of course is can you do it the three times and uh, then mystical okay. can't steal it back from you that's that's the important part so mystical has got a red or blue then a green and a red or blue so red green red so you've done that once so you've done that once that goes over to there on my side here we have a black and a green and you have black here but no so you no green so you don't steal that and there's no green and blue so that is where you are at so you have these prophecies have come back over to you but they're still vulnerable but you do have one that is banked All right, over to Mystical then. You have these four cards. I think, hello, Rogo. Okay, so first one. Uh, first one, we're going to do the green and the blue next to the red green and blue so do you want it with the blue next to the red or the green next to the red blue. the blue okay mm -hmm. and then... then we're going to take the blue red Actually, we'll do the, no, yeah, blue, red. Blue, red, and put the red over top of the green. Oh, the one we've just placed, yep, yeah. okay. So mm -hmm. that's just going to go just there. Oh, I can see what you're doing. All right. <laughs> and you get two new cards. You get a blue and a yellow, a yellow and a red. Okay. I think, yes, Miss Cole, I think this is, you're, you're going to demonstrate this. If you're able to actually, in your turn get three instances of a prophecy you bank it instantly don't you it's it's not open for somebody else to steal it so at this moment in time you've got no prophecies around you but let's see how you do uh blue something blue blue something blue once blue something blue twice oh oh not quite okay so that one comes over to you and you've got it twice uh, we got no yellows, no blacks in that, so that's fine. Let's take a look at stealing from Sarah. You've got green and a red, green and a red, so you do steal that. You've got that once. Goes over there. Uh, blue, green, red, so you've got that once. Comes over there. And you do have an overlap, so there's one overlap, and there's a second overlap. So a red overlap, you've done that twice. That goes just there. All right. And we draw out a new prophecy card. And what we're looking for is a blue and a black. Okay. Let's see. Elhawk, 99. Thanks for joining us. How are you doing? We're just in the middle of playing the game with snakes, with feathered snakes. That's the game we're playing. <laughs> no one's going to correct me. No, no. I'll get away with that one. Okay. 
<laughs> so I need to put down some cards. Black and green. How many times can I do that? Green and blue. Blue and black. Uh, we could do that, couldn't we? Okay. I'm going to put down a black. I'm going to put down a green on top. Draw up to my two cards. Uh -huh. And so we'll take a quick look. So what do we have? Black and green, black and green. So that goes to a two. I should have a look at that one. I don't think it's altered. Green and blue, green and blue. So that remains as a two. Do I have anything? I have a blue and a black. Blue and a black. I'll take that one. That's only down for one. And I don't believe I... Oh, hang on. Blue... You're still for me. Yes, blue, green, blue. Mm -hmm. So I take that one as a one. Uh, I think that is it. Okay. New card out. It's a black on top of another card. We enter the third round. A little marker on. Sarah, here's your cards. Can we move all of the cards on the bottom to the left because your Kofi um, sign covers up the cards that you put fully on the right? There you go. I'll put them up there. Okay. Hmm. I don't know what I want to do. It's taking a look and seeing how can you possibly... Is there any of these prophecies hey, you, you could do free of right um, now? Well... Remember, the main prophecy is to have a green prophecy fulfilled at a lower level than a yellow prophecy. Okay, okay your sound cut out for a minute. Okay, so, and I can put down two cards only, correct? That's correct. Hold on. <laughs> it's funny how how it's the little games that usually cause the most problems. <laughs> not us overthinking, no, not at all. <laughs> <laughs> How do I do that? Wait a minute. No, that does. That's not how I'm supposed to do that. I, I, I what am I, I not I, seeing? I can see something straight away that you could do to be able to bank a card. 
Because that's the okay. kind of what you want to be doing. Right. Which would be what? It's, you need, is you it the blue-green blue one? Oh, no. You need to do something so that you achieve it three times in your turn. Right? Mm -hmm. because, because then nobody else can get hold of it. So looking at the color patterns that you've got, knowing what you can only play two cards... And looking at the prophecies, not only that are out up near the temple, but what other people have, you can achieve it this in this one go. This is the green red. The green red. Mm hmm. Yeah. So to do that. And then put the green on top of it. Yeah. So put down my red blue card. Uh red blue. Yep. Yeah. And then I'm assuming And then I'd have to put one of my greens over it. Let's yeah. put the black green over it. Black green, okay. There you go. Done. Right. So you get two new cards. That's a yellow blue and a black green. All right. So you want to be thinking how you can use those in the next go. But let's then see what you do. So you don't have a yellow something black, so we don't have to worry about that one. You don't have a black over the top of one of your cards. Don't have to worry about that. So we're coming over to what Mystical's got here. Uh, a red or blue, a green and a red. So here we go. Red, yes, green, I have red. That twice. Red, green, red. So you get that one back, and that's on your twice. Now you've got the green and red. Green, red, green, red, green, red. Three times you bank that card. So unfortunately, Mystical's lost out on that one now. Sorry. Over here. You have, I have one red a red over the top, which is just one here. So that goes back over to the one position. Over here, you've got no blues in place. We don't have to worry about those. This one here is a black and a green. Black and green. So this one leaves there and goes over to there. All right. That's you done. Mystical. Your cards are like so. Can you win any of these back? You can get that red overlap, I think, to three, because you already have it done twice, don't you? Yeah. No, I've got it. I've got it once. You sure? The oh, the red overlap. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I think I have that twice. Yeah. Yep. So you could you could manage that, not a problem. But it's again, it's a, a case of trying to optimize, it, isn't it? Because if ideally, if you yeah. could win two cards and bank them. And that's the, the, the mind uh, puzzle that you're trying to do. Mm. Mm. Let's put down the red yellow against the blue. The red, yellow against the blue. Front blue, yeah, yeah. Um, and then let's do the yellow blue with the blue over top of the red. No, you're not going to get your red overlap? No. I mean, you're going to get that one, the three blues, for sure. 
Okay. Are you happy? Oh, you can always get the red overlap on your next turn. Bank that blue one now. Okay, here we go. So you get a blue black. Oh, and a red yellow. Okay. <laughs> so we'll put these away. Right then, what do we have? Uh, you've not got any black over. You've not got a yellow black, so you don't have to worry about those. Uh, you've not got any black green, so that's fine. But we got the red overlap. We got one. We got two, haven't we? So we steal that one back, going over to two there. You have a blue, yellow, blue, blue, red, blue. Blue, yellow, blue, blue, sorry, blue, red, blue, blue, red, blue. So that is three times. So you bank that card. Yay! <laughs> then do you have a blue, black? No. Do you have a green, blue? No. Okay. That's it. You banked a card. Right. My turn. What? Don't I get to take that card from Sarah, though? Which one's that? Sorry. Uh, the red or blue, then a oh. green, then a red or a blue. Yes. Sorry. Yes. This one just here. Yeah. So blue, green, red. So you take that once, don't you? Yeah, there you go. All right. Yes, that's correct, isn't it? Good, good. Um. Oh, I'm, I'm just getting not good cards. Not the one, the cards I want. Uh. That's a green over there, isn't it? I can place that one there. Oh, actually, can I make this work? I think, I think, I think I can. Oh, oh well, actually, yeah, let's do it. I think that's right. Take two cards. So. Red, green, red. Red, green, mm -hmm. blue. Green, blue, green. Hang on, no, hang on, I'm not doing no, it. No, right. no, blue, blue, green, green, blue, green, blue. Yeah, blue, green, yeah, that's it, that's it. I'm coming off here. But I've done it three times, yeah? <laughs> so yeah. that one gets banked over there. Uh, blue, black stays where it is. Green, blue, green, blue stays where it is. I don't think I've got anything over here. Black, green, black, green. Black green, I steal that back. Goes there. That looks about right. Okay. So I don't think there's anything else. Did you oh. draw more cards for yourself? I have, yes. I've taken two more. So we're into the fourth round. This is effectively the final round for putting down feathers and sec sections. The fifth round, we'll be putting the head and the tail onto the snake. So, Sarah, there's your cards. Okay. We will take Can you 
you put a, um, a full card over in another full card, or can it only nope. be half? It's only half. Always trying to break the rules. Okay. <laughs> um... Hmm. So to get the top right card, there's no way I can, even if I did the bottom thing where I have three of the same color in a row, I'm not going to get points for it because I don't have a green mm. that's worth less than a Ex yellow. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah, I don't so think there's no sense in even trying for it. No, I don't think anyone is going to actually achieve that. But there's plenty of opportunity to get other points. Okay. And again, what you it. want to, what you want to do is you want to try and place cards so for either you can so I'm going to take the black green card and put it in front. Black green in front, just exactly as is, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna move the snake up there. There we go. And then I'm going to take the green yellow and put it at the end. Green yellow. Put this at the end, okay. Right, I'm gonna move the box out of the way. Because we uh, we got to the point where we do need a bit of room. Green yellow at the end. Alright, so there is no drawing up of extra cards. They will just uh, disappear now because there's no value to them. All right, let's see what you've got. And we'll do the stealing section first because that's uh, maybe the easiest. So we've got black, green, black, green, black, green. Oh, wow. Okay. You steal that one and you bank it. Done. Uh, no green blues. That's okay. No blue blacks, okay. Red over the top, you've got one. Mm -hmm. So that goes over there. And uh, then we'll just look here. Black over, nope. A yellow something black, no. So I think that's it for you. Do you agree? Yes. Okay. Mystical. Here are yours, which are really, really easy. <laughs> so many options. Oh dear. 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 Uh. Hmm. Are you guys in chat oh, following along in the game? Orientation. What was that? Sorry. Can I flip a card's orientation? Yes. Oh, from absolutely. My okay. Yes, absolutely. Okay. Then we're going to. Oh, I do this. Remember, when you actually put down the head and the tail, they do uh, uh, they are coloured. So of course they will contribute to the fulfilling of prophecies. So you could set yourself up ready, knowing that you might not do it now, but in the very very final turn you could uh, meet that prophecy. Of course, Probably, you but still I have to know what colour the head is. <laughs> well, no, because that's the whole point. The head and the tail you choose. So it can be whatever color it or you require. Ah. You require it. You have a basically a selection of heads and tails in all four colors. The only thing is, is that if somebody else is aiming for the same thing, right, they could beat you to it. Right, that's the gamble. But you know, you might have a, a reasonable measure of what people are trying to achieve at this point. 
Hmm. Okay. Okay. This that changes things. Then hold on. Okay. Um. I do that. Okay. This is. Oh no. Okay. This is gonna be a risk, but we're gonna do it. We're gonna put the black blue beside the blue, and then the same thing, just the black blue again beside the blue. Black blue beside the blue. Black blue beside the blue. Okay. Interesting. All right. Uh, and again, so there's no need to have any new cards. So these are now dead. All right. Let's take a look and see what you've got. You have, well, again, we have a red over the top and a red over the top. We have that twice. So you steal that card back. We are looking for a yellow something black, so that doesn't occur. We're looking for a black over a card, and that doesn't occur. We're looking for green blue. That doesn't occur. We're looking for blue black. Oh, here we go. Uh, one, two, one, two, uh, two. Oh, okay, I can see what you're doing. So you're going to grab that one, and that goes just there. Okay. I see nothing. <laughs> Everything's right. fine. Nothing's going on over here. Don't, no, don't. nothing, nothing. Don't look, don't look. Okay. What's that outside? <laughs> <laughs> oh, look over there. Yeah, I'll look over there. Ah. <sighs> Right, so I know. Where's that gonna go? I need to do that. Right, that's one. So I'm just that card definitely works there. Okay. Uh, uh -huh, uh -huh. And then we got that. We got that. But what can I do? How can I steal that card? So that's a blue. That's a black. You don't want to steal any cards. Don't don't do oh, that. Wait. Don't do that. Oh, I do, I do, I do. No, you don't. No, you right. don't. Stop it. <laughs> so, so that's not going to work for me. That could go... Hmm. <laughs> Sarah and I could help you, but we can't see your cards. <laughs> no, it's that's okay. <laughs> uh, oh, hang on. What? Make right. it an even I'm playing good. field? He I'm... would never. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, I think I can do that. Right. So I'm gonna place. Oh, hang on, hang on, get it right. Green, blue, green, blue, isn't it? Yeah. That should be okay. That goes there. Green, blue, green, blue, green, blue. Right, that banks that one. And that one... That one goes there. I think. We're going to go with that. Okay. So, what do we have? Well, I've just done green, blue, green, blue, green, blue. That is banked. Done. I have blue, black. So I'll take that one back. And I have a red over the top. So I'll take that one. And that's the only instance, isn't it? I think it is. Okay. So, we are now into the final round. So we put our, our head and our tail onto our uh, co 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 
Uh, I, uh, yeah. So, Sarah, you have here, this is your selection of tails. Oh, hang on. Put it right, right around. We got heads. So green, black, blue, and red, and yellow. And then you have tails of black, blue, red, yellow, and green. It is totally up to you what combination thereof that you place to finish your snake. And again, you can place these over in a half if you want to do so. Okay. So you tell I'm me what, what color and where. Yellow head. Yep. I'm going to take the yellow head and place it over top of the front black. Yellow head yeah, over, over the black just there. Done. And what tail? Do it. Do it, Sarah. I guess I would take the black tail. Yes. And, and I guess put it over the yellow. Okay. Black tail over the yellow. Right. Let us see then what you've done. So you have yellow something black. So you get that card. That goes down there. You have a black over a card. So you're going to take this one just here. So that's there. And let me just double check. Uh, double check. And then... Go to, yeah, okay. And then replace prophecy from the deck. Yes, so it will be when it goes to Manda's turn that we will fill that in. So red over the top, you've got one. You're going to take that. That's going to go there. Uh, you've got no blue blacks. So that is it, yeah? Do you agree? Yes. Okay. So we go to... Mystic's turn, but we get new prophecy cards out. Oh. So, could any of this work for you? And it's the same uh, deal with five different colours, heads and tail variations. Now, of course, you want to be considering still the cards, the prophecies that are in play, and also these new ones. Because you could get some bonus points here before you know it. I uh, want a red head over top of the yellow, and I want a black tail against the blue. Yeah, you do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you do. You take that card. <laughs> so you want a black <laughs> tail next to the blue, and a red head over, was it over the yellow, did you say? Yep. Yep. Yeah. It All sure right. was. Okay, well, let's let's see what you have. Uh, red something yellow. Look at that. You get that one in the one. But let's just see. Do we carry on? Red. No, we've got no more yellows in place. So you, you've got that there. All right. Uh, green something green. Nope, not in play. Over to Stealing Sarah's. You've got a red over once. That's one. But you've got it twice. You got it three times. You bank that mm -hmm. card. Done. Black over. No, I'm not seeing that. Yellow. Oh, there's, only one, there's only one more card <laughs> that I'm right. going to take. Uh -huh. uh, mm -hmm. Take yellow. it. <laughs> you, you just know it's mine, isn't it? Yes, okay. Yes. Uh, blue, black, blue, black, blue, black. Done. Banked. <laughs> okay, what? okay. I was thinking maybe there'd be one in there, right? But there's not, is there? Okay. Uh, red something yellow. We did that. That was the one, so that's correct, isn't it? So I think that's you done, yeah? You agree? Yep. Yep. Okay. Uh, new card. 
black something, uh, black, not black, black. Ooh, okay. Uh, oh, now that comes up. Yeah, right? Yeah. Look at mine. Look at mine. <laughs> <laughs> yes, no, exactly. Yeah. Uh, green, not green, green. So green, not green, 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 not green, green. Green, not green, green. Okay, so that's going to get banked straight away for me. So that's good. I can't get that black something black. No, that's not going to happen. Red, red, uh, red. No, not going to happen. Don't you need to have your options of fish heads and stuff? Yes, yes. I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm just working out oh, what, what heads. That's right. It's not an even playing field. We don't get to see your <laughs> options. I forget sometimes. Yeah. Sorry. I've got, I've, got, yeah. I've, got, I've got exactly the same as you. All the same heads, all the same tails. <laughs> right. It's just completely up to me which ones I put out now. But I'm working out uh, which to go for. So I know that I definitely have that one without doing anything. It's whether I can steal anything. Uh, I can't steal this. I potentially can steal the black. I think that's the only one I can go for. Yep, I think that is it. So, I will finish off then with a a black head and a black tail. These can all go back. All right, so, uh, one and two, that comes over here. Green something green, green something green, green something green. That's banked to the six. Done. And I think that's it, isn't it? No. No? Are you sure? You can get another card. Oh. Yep. Uh Oh, right. Yes, black. <laughs> Not black, black. But that's it, isn't it? It's just for that one point. That's true. Okay. That goes there. Oh, it's just for that one point, I guess I'll take. <laughs> one point. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. So, well, it's that just... is... Go on. What can we say? <laughs> no, oh, you, you, you cut out there, Sarah. I didn't, I didn't hear what you said. It said it's just for that one collateral waddle point. Collateral waddle point. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Let's do these. So you've got uh, 18. you got 20 points, Sarah. That's where you're at. Uh, Mr. Do I have a yellow in my six point? Oh, that's a good point. Let's have a look. You Nothing don't. matters. I don't have three you, colors in a row, but I yeah, just figured it, I'd ask. Yeah, no, you have, you have two purples and a green, so no. Um, but let's, well, let's just double check here because Mr. has got a green there. Oh, Mystical's got a yellow. Yeah, but I don't have three colors in a row. No, no, but it's fine. But you get the first three points. Oh, okay. You you're have a you're welcome. You have, you have a yellow <laughs> in a greater position than a green. So, Sarah, you're at 20. Mystical, you are at 23. Because I just gave you those three points. You're welcome. <laughs> no, I, w I knew what I was doing. I was going for That's why I went for that, <laughs> to bank that specific card because I knew I didn't have a yellow in uh banked up and I was like oh, I need to get a yellow so because I don't have a green done yet so I knew I, what I, I was doing I've got three cards banked on my six so that's 18 I've got this one here an extra two so that's my 20 and then this one here as a two is 25 so there we go 25 23, 20. Very close Someone game. Someone was cheating, and I don't think it was either of us, Mr. <laughs> I don't think so, Sarah. I think, I think you're right. Oh, you, oh, I never cheat. I just make mistakes sometimes, but I don't never cheat. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
but not in this game. Not in this game. So, well, there, there you go. That, that was Quaddle Waddle. Uh, what did you think? Did you enjoy it? Well, we have enough time if you go ahead and do some shuffling to, to play another round. You want to, do you want to do that? Yeah, but yeah, you, you yeah. go first this time. Okay, I'll go first. You have to be, we'll have to be real quick. So let's put okay. that there. Close. I'll go last. You go first. Okay. Now that we know what we're doing. So let's put these. We'll bank all of these. So this is the card game version of what I believe there is a uh, a board game. Uh, so this is where they sort of take an element of a game and distill it down to make it into a fast playing version. So I'm really interested to see what the board game's like. Uh, but I, as you pointed out, the artwork is beautiful on these character cards. It's very colourful. And packs away in a nice little box. So it'd be handy for travelling. Okay, so we have those done there. We're going to take a new objective. Uh, okay, so it is a blue lower than a red. And prophecies. You want to have equal or, or equal number of red and green sections as part of your snake. All right. That is the main prophecy. We'll just do a quick shuffle on these. There'll be four cards each. I will start. Oh. oh, back. There we go. Done. Need to take this apart. There we go. That goes there. Right. And we need to have new prophecies each. That's going to be Sarah's. That's Mysticals. That's mine. So, in fact, we can place these straight away onto the zeros. All right. Everybody can see those. We know the relevances of them now. And if we're going to start with me first, and we'll, we'll just make it completely transparent. Oh, what am I going to... Oh, we need to put out two new ones just here. There we go. Ah... Uh, Right, so these are my cards. I'm going to put that one down just there and draw those up. Take a new card, black and a green, done. Sarah, what cards have you got? There's your cards. You just need to select a card. And that will be your starting section. Are you still with us, Sarah? Yeah, but I'm last. Why am I putting something down? Oh, are we are we going back to front then? We get really confusing me. Yeah, okay. I wanted to be in last place. Right, okay. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Mystical, mystical. You choose a card. We're really, really confusing now. Go on. Uh, let's go with... I want to do the green-blue card, but I want the blue, car the blue facing the left-hand side. So, so from what I'm understanding... I'm the pink card on the right, and Monkey, you're the green card on the left, correct? No, no, yes. I'm here. I'm still here. This is me. This is you. We're just going this way now. Oh, okay. I'm you're I'm still in your same position, sir. Whatever. Okay. Just, it really is reversed, so new card for Mystical. Mystical, you're still in the middle. Don't you worry. <laughs> yep, I'm fine. You're, you're absolutely fine. So there we go. You get a green and a yellow card replacement. Right, Sarah. Excellent. Sarah, Sarah. These are your cards. 
You just need to choose one to put down. Let's put that blue black down with the blue facing left. Blue black, blue facing left. Done. I should have done it the other card. <laughs> okay, so we got our snakes and your new card is a black yellow. Right. So, first piece down. Ham. Right. Get to put two cards down. To do that. So, I know I'm going to put that there. And I'm going to put that there. Okay. Draw two up. I get a yellow and a blue. I get another yellow and a blue. Great. Uh, what do I manage to get? I get this one. I get a red and a yellow and I get it twice. I get a blue and nothing. So I get that once. I get a blue, nothing, red. I get that once. And that is me done. New prophecy goes out. Mystical, your turn. There's your cards. New prophecy is yellow, not yellow, yellow. Oh, good. <laughs> uh, okay, let's do the green, yellow, and, and have the yellow touch the blue. Green, yellow, have the yellow touch the blue. Done. Then let's do... Uh, let's do the green, yellow, but flip the yellow and have the yellow over top of the green at the back end. Yellow over Actually, the green? Actually, no, just put it on the front. Just tack it on the front the way it is. That's fine. Just the way so it is? It yeah, also, lift up your card on the right, monkey, so we turn can it, see what the card is. It, so right. it's it's no, so it should pattern. Pattern, other way, yep. Other way. Yep. So <laughs> green, green, yellow, green, yellow, blue, green. Yes. Yep. There oh, we okay. go. Excellent. New card: black, red, black, green. Okay. Done. Right. What have you got? Uh, you've got a yellow something, something yellow, so you steal, well, you take that one, done. You've got a green something blue, green something blue, you take that one, done. You have, you got no reds, you've got a blue. Oh, did I, I, I took that one, I took a blue. And it's ah ah I shouldn't have been taken. Who was that, was that up on the was that it was mine? Was that yours? The that's, blue and then the, the yeah yeah that's still the blue and then the not blue over yours. top of something. Is exactly yes mine. that was that was incorrect. So that goes there and that stays there because no one's achieved no. that one. Yeah, she had. No, oh, no. it's over top. It's got to okay. be a, yeah. it's got to be a card that's not a blue over the top of the next card. So okay. that's. Yeah. Yeah, so I knew what it mistake. was, but I was like, okay, maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, no, 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 <laughs> you're quite right. So that's there. Uh, okay, not got that. A yellow, black, no. And a red, yellow, no. So I think we're correct on that, yes? Yep, yep. Yep, all right, excellent. Uh, Sarah. Oh, sorry, mark it. We have a green over the top, a yellow over the top. Uh, there's your cards. Um, okay. We're going to take the black red and put it over top of the black. Which one's going over the black? Black. You want black over black? Yeah. Okay. 
Let's see what, let's see what you're doing. <laughs> and then... Oh, yes. We're going to take the yellow, black, and we're going to flip it. Yellow, we're black. we're going to put it next to the red. So you want the yellow next to the red? Mm-hmm. Done. All right. Two new cards. Black, red. Black, red. All right. Nice and easy. Let's see what you got. There's no greens. There's no yellow over the top. Looking here, no green and blues. No double yellows. But you have got a blue and a non-blue over the top. So you steal that one. That goes there. You have a blue, something red, so you steal that one. Mm -hmm. Is that Yellow. how that works? Yeah. because it's. I thought it had to be the same card. Hmm. No, bl 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 <laughs> blue, any, any color red. So blue, any color red. That's fine. I took his card. You sh he you sh your pretty face. Sh <laughs> <laughs> you just ha you're just happy just getting one over on me. That's fine. Uh, yellow and black, yellow and black. Yes, you take that one. Uh, take all your cards. Red and yellow, you do take all of my cards. I will be taking them yeah. all back. Believe me. <laughs> okay. But it doesn't matter because for that moment you had them all taken from you. So you you have taken all of my cards, right? Second round. Okay, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? I'm going to put my cards over here. See, there you go. You can see my cards. Um, I am going to... Hmm. Do, 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 what am I gonna do? <laughs> I'm just, lo just looking up at the two of you, just chatting amongst yourselves. It's not fair. <laughs> um, ah, 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 ah. I can't. Well, Your clip lose, is working perfectly. Lose something there. Sorry, my husband got home, so the dogs are excited. Hmm. That's not going to work. Oh, okay. What is the card next to the two? Like the third card at the top that looks like car seats. What is that? <laughs> it's a temple. Oh, the temple, the temple. Oh. <laughs> because of course they had car seats in aztec times of course they did right yeah? it's a temple you're right okay sorry everyone <laughs> it looks like car seats with like the headrests i'm sorry oh okay i'm going to put yellow black there i'm going to agrees and that's what matters i'm going to regret this And I'm gonna put that one. I, I don't like this already. Putting that over there. Okay. Typical. Typical. Okay. Right. So, what do I get? What do I get? Uh, red, yellow, red, yellow. 
That's in a two. Oh, let me just put that up there then. Uh, yellow, black is a one. Blue something red, blue something red is a one. I know that I don't have that because of the conditions. I don't have any green. I have yellow something yellow, yellow something yellow, yellow something yellow. That goes as a two. Mm. And then I have yellow over something, which is just there. Yellow over yellow, doesn't matter. Uh, that goes as a one. New card out. Black, not black over a card. Mystical. Uh, those are your cards. Let's put the red yellow against the green at the front. Red yellow against the green at the front. And then uh, don't like it. Let's do Let's do the green red, but flip it so the green is touching the red. At green the front. red at the front, like so. Okay. Two new cards, another green red, and a red yellow. All right, done. Let's see what you have. So you don't have any greens overlapping. You don't have any blacks. So we've dealt with that. You don't have a blue and a blue overlapping. Nope. You have a green something blue, green something blue. She's already in play. That's done. Uh, okay. You've got a yellow overlapping. No. You've got a blue something red. No. Yellow black. No. Yellow something yellow. Yellow something yellow. So you steal that card back into the two position. Uh, red, yellow. You steal this one back into the one position. Uh, I think that's it, isn't it? Do you agree? Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep. Oh, all right. Sarah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. There you go. I guess we could put that yellow black at the end. Yellow black at the end. Okay. And then take my green black. Yep. And put it in front of the blue. Green. So you want it as green, black. Yep. Mm -hmm. There you go. In front of the blue. Two new cards. Yellow, blue. 
green blue. All right, let's see what you got. Uh, no green over the top. A black... With then not a black over the top? Nope. Blue... With then something that's not blue over the top, so that's one, so that's still there. A red and a yellow, so you steal that. That goes into the one. A green something blue. Yep, you steal that. That goes into a one. Yellow something yellow. You steal that. Goes to the one. Sorry, you'll get it back. <laughs> <laughs> you call her, yourself her friend. Oh, unbelievable. Uh, yellow over something. No. Blue something red. Yep, you steal that. Goes there. Yellow, black, yellow, black. Yep, that goes as a two. Oh, no, I dropped my phone. All the way across the room. Okay. <laughs> okay. I think that's you done. Do you agree? I do believe so. Okay. Into the third round. <sighs> How can I win some of these back? Well, I think I'm safe in doing red, yellow, red, yellow. Not what I wanted to do, is it? Blue something red. I don't have to mess things up too much. I can put that there. I think this is going to be a hard fought game. I'm going to put that yellow over the top there. All right. Two cards. Black and red. Yellow and green. Let's see what we've got. Don't do anything on those top. I do have now a yellow over and a yellow over. So I moved that up to a two. All right, I'll put it there so you can see it. Blue something red. So that's as a one. Done. Yellow something yellow. Yellow something yellow. Yellow something yellow. So I've banked my first card. Gonna have it next round. I was gonna have it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's no greens and blues for me, so that's fine. Red, yellow, red, yellow. So that's a two. And I've got nothing with blue and blue over. So I think that is it. Oh, hang on. Yellow, black. I do have the yellow, black, don't I? So I'll take that one. Yep. I think that is me done. Uh, Mystical, here's your cards. Don't like it. Yeah, I do. I do think this is going to be a hard won game. We're going to be clawing for every card and point on this one. Let's go. Oh, why did why why did you have to do that, monkey? Why why why? <laughs> <laughs> I don't 
like it. Okay, let's do the red and yellow at the front. Red and yellow at the front. Done. And then... Let's do the black and red at the back end with the black overlapping the green. Okay. Done. Two new cards. You get a green and red. A blue and red. All right. Let's see what you have. Uh, no green overlapping. A... Black with a not black overlapping. Nope. Okay. Green something blue. So you got it there. That goes one. We don't have the... Ah, okay. Blue with not blue overlapping. That's a one. <laughs> Give there. me my card back. <laughs> uh, then over here. <laughs> yellow, black, no. Blue, something red, yes. You've got that one just there. Red, yellow, red, yellow, red, yellow. That becomes a two. And then a yellow overlapping, no. Does that look correct? Yep. Yep, all right. Sarah? Um, so, I'm going to take that blue-yellow, maybe not, hold on a moment, please. <laughs> Sarah, look at the, oh, ah. Uh. You're not allowed to help. That's not fair. <laughs> hmm. Okay, I'm going to take my yellow. And then I'm going to put it over top of the green. And take the which which is going over the green. Taking the yellow and putting yep. it over the green. Okay, yellow over the green. Oh uh, no, I'm monkey. I just mishear things when I think it's not going to work <laughs> in my favor. <laughs> When I'm the most direct with my directions, you're like, what? What's this? But if what? I'm just like, oh, take that card over there, you're like, oh, I know what you're talking about. Cool, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, what? That's, that's, that's a flagrant lie. It's a lie, I tell uh, you. you. You couldn't even say it without stumbling over the words. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> no pretty tip. <laughs> um, and then <laughs> hmm. let's take. <laughs> the green and put it on top of the blue. Good girl. The green <laughs> is going on top of the blue. <laughs> yep. Okay. Two new cards. Green, black. Blue, red. 
Right. Let's see what damage you do. Black and yellow, black and yellow. <laughs> yes, 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 I know. <laughs> but we're starting from the top. So you've got a green over something, and that's the only one. So you take that one. That goes for a one. You've got a black with then a black over the t something over the top that's not a black. I'm not seeing that, so that's no. Uh, blue something red. Blue something red. Yep, you've got that one. you got that for a one. Blue, not blue over something. So you got mm -hmm. that once. Blue. And I have it like blue. twice, or you did twice? I cover yeah. it up? Yeah, you got it okay. twice. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm just, I'm just going through each step. Green something blue. Nope, that's not happening. Red, yellow. Yep, you've got that once. Okay. Yellow black. Yellow black, yellow black. So you bank your first card. Done. Yellow over something. You've got it once yep. here. Done. Do you agree? I agree. Okay. Does the player to my left concur? All right. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. We've got a new prophecy. It is... Colors are equal on either side of a green. Ooh. Okay. Uh, we're into the fourth round. Right. right get right, right. that one, Amanda. <laughs> <laughs> you done banked it. <laughs> it's already banked. You don't even have to try. Uh, exactly. Yeah. 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 I am just going to stay. Am I going to stay with the plan? There was a plan. Oh, now he has a plan. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to do it. There you go. Let's put those two just there. I'll just put those are my cards. I'm going to put the that and that. Oh, gosh. All right. So no, I don't like it. No, I, I I don't like it. Take back that move. I don't like it. <laughs> so okay, I can't do this and I can't do that. So we don't have to worry about that. Let's come and look at this one. Green and blue? No, not an issue. Uh blue and then something that's not a blue over the top. So that's just here. I'll take that one for one. Yellow over the top. We got one. We got two, we got three. I'm going to bank that card. Red and yellow. Red, yellow, red, yellow, red, yellow. I'm going to bank that card. Blue, something red. Blue, something red. I'm going to put that as a one. Uh, I think that's it. I don't think I can't, I can't take that green, can I? Nope. Okay, that's me done. Uh, Amanda, yours. Just a reminder: this is the final round. Next round is heads and tails. <laughs> Oh, no, I don't like it. Let's put the blue on top of the red at the front. Since there's no point in going for that card anymore. Sorry, was that a blue? Blue on top of the red at the front. Blue on top of the red at the front. Blue on top of the red at the front. Done. Uh, now we're going to take the red green and flip it so the green is against the red at the front. Red green. 
green is against the red at the front. Done. Uh, I've just done it to mine, but of course that means these cards are now discarded. Because that is it. So, let's see what you have. You have... So... Something... Red. Green, red. So that's one. So you grab that one. Let's just double check. Green, something blue. Green, something blue. Green, something blue. That one moves up to two. Let's just check here. An overlap with a green. Nope. Blue, something red. Blue, something red. Yep, yeah, that's happening once. Blue, something red. It's happening twice. Blue with a not blue overlap. Happening once. Does that look correct to you? No. What am I missing? Well, the, the green, shouldn't I bank that? Because it's unequal. I have it like four times. We do. Oh, of course, one, yes, sorry, um, yeah, uh, one there, one there, yes, one there, one there, you're quite right, sorry, my bad, banked, done. Oh no, I just, in, I just oh, innocently didn't see that, <laughs> oh no, I know. Oh, come on, come on, you... I expect you two to tell me when you see something. It's very unusual for you not to do so. <laughs> no, we said at the very front when it came up, well, Mystic just banks that, and you said, yes, absolutely, she does. So yeah. you think but that, that, was a, that was a whole three <laughs> minutes ago. <laughs> Everything's changed. <laughs> okay. Have I got everything? Yes, now you have Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. New prophecy. Oh, okay. Oh, well, gosh, Sarah, this is good for you as well. Uh, okay, I'm going to put your cards over here. Just to confuse you. There you go. There's no way for me to bank that, though. Oh, yeah, there is. Yeah, there is. There is. Hmm. So... Yami, please quit licking your paw. You're very distracting. <laughs> Sorry. I'm trying to focus and all I hear is my dog licking her paw. I just had it. Now I forget how I was going to do it. Okay. Because we have that. Now, no, no, I'm wrong. Now no, I don't know how I'm right. supposed to do it. No, oh, I can do stuff being surrounded by black, though. Well? No, I can only do it twice, huh? Sarah, you can set it up. You can set it up. Yeah. Set it up. I don't know if I want to go <laughs> the black and green route or the black and red route. Oh, 
So I guess I'll take my red and black and put it on the back end. Red and black on the back end. I mean, no, but okay. Well, yeah, I guess I could do it like that. So is that my first card down? That's your first That's card your down. First one. And then, so if I put the red one next, if I put the red black one next to that, can I see what that would look like? A red black would go over there. I'm not going to put it next to it, but it's give you an idea. Is this our last turn? For you, yes. Well, yes, because next, after that, it's heads and tails. So as Manda's saying, you are setting it up potentially for your head and your tail. Okay, then hold on. Okay, can you... You might not bank it, but you might just... Remember, you're last. No. So, so once you've won it... No one else is going to be able to steal it from you. Which, of course, puts me in a very precarious position because there's things that I wanted to do, but I know... Oh, I already it's... put down a card, right? I already put down yep. that first red and black one? Yep. Yep. You've only got these cards to choose from now. Okay, so I'm going to put my green and black in the front. Green and black in the front. Mm -hmm. Cover the blue. With the green? Yeah, hold on a second. Yeah, cover that blue with the... No, wait. No, with the black, sorry. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, hold on. I think I know what you're doing, but let me just double check on this to make sure it is valid. This just going to. I know it's going to. So it's saying here, create a match. Do an example. So it would be match, black, match pattern. So i.e. in this instance, it would be, say, green, black, green, or even black, black, black. No, but she's she set it but up, yes. right? But yeah, you can't. I, I think... Just I think it doesn't matter. It's, it's the rule that's correct. It's not the replication of the colors, is it? So I think you'd be okay. Hold with on. That. Yeah, hold on one second. Because you're doing it across multiple colors, but the rule is consistent. Yes, but hold one moment, please. Okay. I think I think you've done it. Can I have you rotate my red and black one? Red and black one like this. Why, yes. sir? Just thank you. Okay. Right, are you done? Well, yes. Right, that's it. Okay. That's it. Okay, so... I mean, let's... I still get the card, it's just... It's at a two right now. Okay, let's see what you've got. So... We're going for like colours over a black. Green, green, green with a black. Yellow and yellow with a black. 
So you get that, that goes to a two. You've got a black and then not a black over the top. Uh, nope, not seeing that. Green over the top on one. That's just there. That's done. A blue and then not a blue over the top. Blue, not a blue over the top. You take that one. Blue something red. That's for one. Green something blue. Nope. And I've got nothing here. So that's it. So, do you, do you agree? Sarah? Um, I think so. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Let's go with that. Final. Put the little pieces in. There we go. Got a snake. Okay. We do have one final prophecy. Yellow, green. Blue, yellow, green. Uh, and it is now heads and tails. So... If I did a yellow, that'd be one. That'd be two. That's a two on there. What can I do? That me one. Ah. I'll get that one. The blue on the top and get that. So I'm looking at it potentially that and nope. No on that. <laughs> uh, well, we have to commit, so we're going to put a yellow head. <sighs> yeah, it's not going to work on that. I don't think I don't think there's anything I can do that's gonna get me the points. So I think I can put anything at the back. I think. Yeah. Okay. We're just gonna do it because it's pretty. There you go. Done. Mystical. Oh, hang on. But I need to do the uh, the things, don't I? Sorry. So, uh, 
Yellow, blue, yellow. Yellow, blue, yellow. That card goes to a two. I don't have a green something blue. That's fine. I don't can you have... lift that card up so we can see the bottom? Yep. Done. I don't have something black something. So that doesn't do. Blue something red. Blue something red. Yep. So that goes to a one. Uh, blue overlap. Yep. Goes there. Green overlap. No. That's me done. New card. Ah! <laughs> That's just not fair. Okay. <laughs> Mystical, what would you like to put out? <laughs> so we just need a head and a tail. Yeah. Ah, oh, that's really annoying. That's really annoying. <laughs> Let's do... A green tail. Green tail. Okay. Is that covering anything or just going? Nope. Just nope. just by itself. Yep. Gotcha. Okay. And let's do. a blue head blue head done all right let's see what you get what are you gonna win uh <laughs> green something blue that's fine green something blue that's fine so that remains blue we've no, that doesn't work. Oh, hang on. Blue something over. So that goes to there. That's a one. And then a blue, blue, blue something red twice. Something red, yep. Blue, blue something red twice, yep. So that goes back over to here. Uh, let's just look at this one here. So yellow or green with a blue in between. That's yellow, but it's not got the yellow thing, so I don't think you get that card. It's not on that one. Green over the top. No. So it's black over the top. No, but here's the one you're going to get. So red something red. Red something red. So that gets two points. Oh, sorry, in, into the, the two zone. That goes there. Do you, uh, do you agree? Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah. Okay. That's you done. New card, which is... Oh, and again, favours favors Sarah there. It's a black something green. We're going to go with the red head and a black tail. We'll put the black over the red. Red head. <laughs> black tail. With the black, was that sorry? What did you say? The black over the red. Black is covering the red. Yes. Okay. Interesting. So I'm gonna bank that card. Yep. Uh, because we got black something black, black something black, black. Still black. Black. Thanked. 
you've got a green over so that stays as that mm. black something green no black with a black over the top oh, no black, black with black something black not black over the top. <laughs> yeah so that's correct so that one comes down here looking at mysticals then blue with something that's not blue over the top you got that so you steal that one back again uh oh, sorry mystic not that one it's fine blue something red yep yeah. we we as long as we can dethrone him <laughs> yeah <laughs> i'm so mean uh green something blue no no and then Green or no. yellow with a blue? No, that's not happening either, is it? Okay. Right. Gosh! Okay, well, here we go then. Uh, I have three cards banked, so that's 18. And then I have five points at the side here, so that's 23. Uh, Mystical, you have six with two... Wait, did you do anything from the top card? Do anything from the top card? This one here. Yeah. No, uh, yeah. Did you do anything from there? That's what I was trying to achieve. And no, because this is a green card. I did have the pe purple card. So I had the purple card as being higher as my six, but I needed the blue and you kept on stealing the blues all back all the time. Oh no. Oh no. So no. So I get, I get 23. Uh, Mystical, you have 16 because you have a yellow as your bank, and these are, there's a yellow and a green as your fives. If it, if it matters at all, my, my, my red and green are equal. <laughs> uh, yes, no, well, yeah. Uh, <laughs> and that's something I was, go was going for. I, I, I might be getting this slightly wrong, so in fact, yeah, maybe I've 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 done myself a disservice, and maybe I'm going to get let you guys win on this now, um, because rereading this, it does say. Let me just get this right. Here we go. Hang on. Each temple card depicts two objectives. If you complete one of the objectives, you score three prestige points. If you complete both of them, you score seven. So you would get some prestige points for it. Yeah. I've, I was reading it initially that you had to do the first one to do the second one, but you don't. So, you just have to do so one you, or the other. So Amanda right. got extra so points. Have, so so Amanda, I get 19 you, points. You'll get three points for it because of, yes, your reds and your greens equaled. Yeah. Does that mean first game I maybe would have gotten some extra points? I don't quite remember. We can always It doesn't much matter. It doesn't matter. I, I would have still lost, but okay. Continue. Right. So yes, you get extra points for that. Uh, it's only if you achieve both of them do you get the seven points. Um, so you don't have to do the top and then do the bottom. And that's, I think, where I was getting it slightly confused. Okay. Sarah, you've got 12 banked. And then you've got 13, 14, 15, 16. Oh, no, hang on. No, hang on. Two, four, six. You've got eight with 12 banks. So you got 20. I do apologize. Let's and, do, then, and, and then, and then, well, there you go. You've now got your seven points, haven't you? Because you've got the purple down at the bottom here, and you definitely have the blues in here. So you do achieve both of those objectives. So you get seven bonus points. So there you go. So 27. So what does that mean? Well, it means you win. <laughs> 27, 25, and 19. <laughs> Excellent. We did it, Sarah. <laughs> High five. There we go. Ro Rogue has got the, I got the scores I feel like in there. the person who gets to go last, I feel, has an advantage in this game. Do you think so? I suppose yeah, maybe. Absolutely. A, 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 yes, because they get to steal all the final cards, don't they? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that is true. Unless, unless the people like unless first or middle can can pull ahead quickly, then last is is going to have the advantage every time. 
But so unless beep, first beep. and middle can bank cards? That's exactly it. If it, it first gets the opportunity to bank it instantly if they can. And that being the case, last doesn't even get a look in. So last is pick, potentially picking up scraps. I think I it, still it, it depends feel on like players. there's a slight advantage to being last. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, I, I have the same feel. That's why I wanted to play again as the last person. <laughs> I didn't even get an option. It was just, nope, you're in the middle, Mystic. I mean, you could have gone first, first, but I was like, I'm, don't you enter this, con don't enter this, this. Um, <laughs> no, you are not in the argument, young lady. Um, <laughs> that's why I was like, I'm last, whatever, you, you know, doesn't matter as long as I'm last. <laughs> Okay, well, maybe what we will do then is we will do a, a, a replay of this at a later point and swap those roles around uh, so that uh, Mystical can play last or first. And uh, let's mix up the uh, the playing order and see what happens. I like it. I think it's, it's a fun little game. Fun and, and it's pretty. And we, we played much, much quicker, obviously, in, in that second, which is always the way, isn't it? Once you uh, get a good yeah. feel of a game, you start blasting through. Rogo, you're saying fun to watch. Glad you enjoyed. Glad you enjoyed. Um, yeah, no, I like it. Nice fun. Very, very colourful. Beautiful art in the uh, in, in the characters. They look absolutely stunning. Really, really do. I'd be, again, interested to see what the full board game experience is like. But as a, as a, a takeaway game, uh, if you were going away on holiday, you could quite easily put this into a, your rucksack and, uh, and uh, you know nice and easy to carry so uh yeah and, and, and what's it what's it called what's it called <laughs> it's it's called the feathered snake game that's what waddle it's called with it at a sea waddle at a sea quaddle waddle, waddle with a co 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 coddle 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 no coddle. don't try to replace the w just <laughs> add the c to wobble what wobble what, 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 no what, 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 wobble <laughs> Addy seed to waddle. Cod, quad, quaddle. 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 Uh, Rogue, is, Rogue is asking serious questions. It's one to four players. There is actually uh, a solo player mode. And also, there's an expansion within the game for if you do have the board game, you can add elements from this into the board game and enhance your board game experience. Okay. So it's, that's a, a nice little idea. Uh, it does say to, to play within 25 minutes. I think that once you've played it a few times and got used to it, yeah, you probably could cut down the time. We, we've managed to play it in around that sort of time, so not too bad. So there you go. This is from Synapsis Games. And uh, yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. All right then, so there we go. That was our game for tonight. Thank you very much, both of you, for joining us. Thank you for having us. Thank Even. you for having us. Very welcome. Thank you. <laughs> okay. I'll look do, you regret, do you regret having us both on here now? Uh, I'm going to keep you separated as much as possible from this point onwards. <laughs> I, I think that might be the best option. <laughs> um, well, we'll see what game we are playing next week. I have an idea; could be interesting. Um, so, yes, I will. Uh, we'll, we'll sort something out uh, very soon for that. All right. Have a great weekend, both of you. Okay, bye. Bye bye now. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, so my thanks to Sarah and Mystical for playing tonight's game of Coatl from Synapsis Games. A uh, lot of fun, very colourful, uh, nice and easy to learn. I like these type of games, uh, especially if I do win every now and again. <laughs> uh, have a wonderful weekend, everybody. Look forward to seeing you next week with some more role-playing game and some more tabletop games for us to have a look at. Uh, but until then, bye for now. <laughs>